I work with patients with cannabis only in the office at the Relief Institute. Two very close family members were diagnosed with cancer. Both of them were at different stages. Uh, one had breast cancer and was young, and one was older in his 60s or 70s. Both of them were recommended by their physicians to start using cannabis products. Both their oncologists say, you should probably smoke pot and it'll help. The same question came coming up. What are they supposed to do? How are they supposed to do it? How often are they supposed to use it? What is it good for? What is it not good for? What should we look out for? I, you know, we don't want her to be high all day because she's got little kids around. How do we do this better? And what ended up happening, which I know happens for a lot of individuals, is we went into a pot shop, uh, talked to a bud tender, who sometimes gave us good advice and sometimes didn't give us good advice. So for the 40-year-old female, she did really well and kind of figured it out. For the 70-year-old male, he didn't. 